Hello YouTube, this is me Indra. In the previous tutorial, I have created a login form with the database and now I will show you how to insert data into database in the window which you have created earlier. That means in this window. For insert operation, I will be using test box, ready buttons, check box and combo box. Since using all these items in the project, it will be lengthy so I will be dividing the project into two parts. In the first part, I will be creating a database and designing design and insert form. In the second part, I will perform the database connection and event and link. So let's begin our project. First of all, let me drag and drop a panel in this window and stretch this to the whole area. Also, let me drag and drop some labels this is for name this one is for address and this one is for gender similarly this one is for knowledge and this one is for subject so for name let me drag and drop text, fi text field this is for name this one is for address for gender we need radio buttons we need two radio buttons one for male and the other one for female similarly for checkbox we will be using two checkbox so let me drag and drop over here two checkbox and I will be using sorry two check box and one com combo box for subject so let me rename all these this is name and this one is address gender knowledge So let me rename this also. This is for name. Let me just take this is male. Similarly, this is female. Also, this is let me write Java. to rename the items in combo box first of all right click on this and go to properties then after in properties go to model and click on this button then after delete all this and write the name of subject here for me computer science management amenities much and click on ok and click on close then after let me rename all these variable name this is name and this one is address and this one is male female let me write it to Java, Java may not be allowed it. The variable name Python. Then after this is subject. Okay. Since using gender, let me show you by running this project, and I'll explain you it to you.
okay this this will be our inter interface since both the read buttons are selected here we have to only select one here but we can select both in the checkbox in read button we have to select only one so let us do for let us do for this we have to use button group group to make a single selection for that drag and drop bottom group in this interface and click on the mail ready button right click on the mail ready button and go to properties then in button group select button group 1 and click on close similarly in female also right click and go to properties and in button groups select button group and you have to make same button group for both male and female let me run and show you it again and click on sign in ok only one is selected now now all of this works so our design of insert form is ready so let me create a database now so let me minimize this so to create database we will be using SQL server so open the SQL server provide the username and password and click on connect so I will be using I will be creating a new table to store the data in the earlier tutorial I have created a table test so I will be creating a new table with with multiple columns so let me write the name first of all symbol number this will be type integer integer do not allow null for this then after name this will be back here you can allow null for this then after address back here then after gender this also will be back here back here and the last one is subject this also will be back here and let this symbol number be our primary key and let it be auto increment also in identity specification double click and and make this is identity to yes then after click on press ctrl s to save the file and let me write the name table name users then click on ok so our table users has been created let me refresh this ok we can view over here let me see the select of thousand rows and the table is empty so we will insert data in this table with the help of java that we have designed in the netbin so thanks for watching please like and subscribe my channel in the next tutorial i will show you how to perform the event handling and database connection thanks for watching